Hi guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. I am Gibbs with the Queen here. Hi, I'm Amelia. Welcome everyone. Yeah, we just thought of giving you again another quick update on the progress on our project. So yeah, we are going to have uh, the project manager as well as the contractor give you some updates. Uh, they've been working on the roof, uh, plastering and uh, plumbing work. Yeah, so the roo um, rooftop deck is done, um, the floor, and I think now we're kind of like looking at um, the shade of the... Yeah, yeah, I mean like uh, the cover of the entertainment deck. Yeah. So that piece is not yet done, but the roof of the, you know, uh, of the main house is, uh, is in place now. Yes. And also they've been working on plumbing so they did put the septic tank in and today the inspectors came to look at the progress and give their go ahead uh, to proceed with the project yeah so pretty much a city council approved the plumbing work so good to go and uh, probably this is gonna be our last update before the holidays because yeah. very soon the uh, they will be breaking for holidays and uh, of course uh, the next big project for us is uh, the windows and the doors <laughs> oh yeah that uh, they're quite pricey <laughs> yeah that was yeah so we are bracing for that we don't know yet when we will have those in place uh, we are still kind of again working some numbers here but yeah so that will be the next big um, thing uh uh, that we are going to be working on actually uh they uh have been uh working on the floors to prepare them for tiling mm. of course tiling will come after the windows and the doors are in place so that will be again another next phase of the project uh greetings everyone uh another episode on house kanyongo yeah uh, we have been going through a lot of months of uh, hard work and um happy and we take pride uh, out of our work and uh now the project is uh on uh, on a stage where we do the final touches uh, from specialist works and finishes and what we have covered so far on the project is from the roofing and then plastering and that now now the floor screening we are, uh, we are almost done with the plastering and we are now waiting for the aluminium uh, windows and doors and also the uh, steel fabrication for our canopies. We have been going through a, a, a lot of a number of search in terms of quotations for aluminium works and uh, I think we have found uh, our guys we are going to do the uh, that uh, specialist work and uh, I'm sure they will do a good job and uh, when we are done with the aluminium, uh, the wow factor will come out. And uh, I think it's going to be interesting. So some other works which have been covered by the contractor, uh, from uh, plumbing works to electrical, and we are almost done with that. Uh, the septic tank has been done and the soccer way is about to be uh, finished. And we are looking on some other materials which are needed for uh, the uh, skimming, building skimming and uh, uh, painting. So we're now at the finishing stage of our build. Um, we're happy to say we've uh, completed the superstructure uh, with the roof now being available overhead. Um, we managed to complete the roof installation as well as uh, the building of the parapet walls which uh, sort of hide the roof from a design perspective uh, giving the building a flat roof look uh, despite the fact that we've actually used uh, chromatic uh, roofing sheets at a slight uh, pitch uh, to drain our, our water. We've also managed to work on uh, some of the major gutter beams that will uh, take that uh, rainwater out from the building and expel it to ensure that our structure is free of leakages um, and uh, our team has made good progress on the plastering with the interior plastering having been completed whilst the exterior plastering is almost done 
we're now just touching up uh, a few of the parapet walls right at the top of the structure. We've also started on the interior screeding of the floors and we've completed uh, screeding of the first floor and are currently halfway through screeding of the ground floor. Uh, the screed is basically a rough uh, cement and, uh, uh, and river sand mix that ensures that all our floors are flat and ready for, for tiling to commence. In the background, our plastering team, our plumbing team rather, has also been working on the drainage um, and we've done the trenching uh, and the drain laying. Um, we've also managed to construct the septic tank, uh, which will be servicing uh, the drainage. Uh, and we have uh, also dug the soak away um, and we're just uh, awaiting uh, back filling with, uh, with rock and rubble uh, before we cover it up completely and commission our plumbing works. The electrician has also been making good progress with the wiring um, and uh, again as we move now to this phase of the finishing, uh, once uh, the aluminium doors and windows go in, we'll come back and do the window reveals with our plastering team and then skimming can commence of the interior walls um, and then from skimming we'll be looking to complete the, the floors with uh, tiling once uh, the design choices have been made on selection of tiles. Yeah, yeah, so we're excited, we're making progress uh, slowly but surely, you know, and this project is not without challenges, yes. like we said, you know, we've We've had a lot of challenges. Yeah, along the way. <laughs> and, you know, some of those challenges were shared with you. And, uh, yeah, we are going to make a video. Uh, one of the videos we are going to make about the challenges we have experienced, you know, or lessons learned. Yes. <laughs> yes, it's, it's yeah. very different. I mean, I don't know most of you people who live in the diaspora, you know, Europe, uh, America, you know, Canada, you know that customer service out here is very different from back home. Back home, they're just so relaxed. You know, there's no hurry in Africa. <laughs> yeah. We're coming tomorrow, but we'll come next week and no communication whatsoever. So that has been our challenge is just trying to push people, push people like, come on, you guys. You know, so it's been very frustrating. Uh, and we've been working diligently with our project manager to try, you know, and make sure that things get done when people say they're going to do something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you know, overall, for the most part, you know, we have made good progress and we are happy with where we are at. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, uh, we again just sort of sharing with you this um, this information. Uh, as you said, this is probably our last update uh, before the holidays, and uh, that to wish all of you. Merry happy Christmas. holidays. Happy holidays. Yes. Yeah. yes, happy holidays. Stay well, stay safe, be blessed. And as always, thank you for watching our channel. Thank you to those who have subscribed and to those who haven't. Please consider subscribing. Like the video. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. I mean, and for those who are working on a project, we're in this together. Please, you know, <laughs> yes. share your stories, share your challenges. Someone might learn from you. Yeah. And uh, actually, we've had uh, a few people we are kind of sharing information with who have started their projects and um, yeah, asking questions. And um, we are happy that we are able to help a few people. Yeah, so, absolutely. Yeah, so again, thanks, guys. And um, we'll, we'll see, see you, you in, in the next, next year. Video. Yes, <laughs> it be next year. All right. Okay, take care.